Yo, 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 what's good everybody? It's your boy Brandon, also known as the Georgia Picker, and I am here with... Your wifey. It's a wifey, and it is uh, November 4th. It is a Saturday. Apparently, my neighborhood's having a community sale. I think there's two other community sales. It's probably about a 15-ish minute drive, and then just kind of like little random ones sprinkled in. Um, but it's cold this morning. It's 41 degrees. <laughs> it's a little cold this morning, so... Uh, that should definitely warm up during the day or a little bit later is what I should say um, We're gonna do what, do what we normally do. We're gonna go out there find some deals Hopefully make some profits and uh, you know keep doing this thing full-time We've been going strong at it for almost four years this upcoming March of 2024 So it's kind of kind of wild to think about it's been a long journey um, Been a very long journey to try to get to this 10,000 subscribers uh, again I don't think we're gonna get it this year, but again, I'm not gonna get my hopes up We're just gonna keep grinding get out keep producing these uh these videos for you guys that way you guys can learn where i can educate myself as well with certain things that i pick up and uh, overall just really just a fun time gonna spend uh, pretty much all day with the wife and then of course georgia bulldogs play at 3 30 today against uh, missouri we're gonna see what happens with that game but um but yeah it's pretty pretty exciting day today a lot of stuff going on uh with that being said wifey any words of encouragement for the day i just want to stay warm that's all I want to stay warm. Hey, man, that's, if that's not encouraging enough, then I don't know what we're doing in life because I'm trying to warm up the truck now. So, words of encouragement by me. No days off. Go do what you got to do to make your money. Um, with that being said, much love. Let's go ahead and get into the uh, first yard sale. Oh, look at that. How much are your bags? They're all different prices. Different prices? Just Fifteen. Fifteen? How about this one? 35. 35. I gotta ask, would you do 40 for the pair? So $10 off? Or $5 off per one if I buy both of them? Perfect. All right, cool. Thank you. I appreciate that. Reasonable man. We had people yesterday who were like, these are like name brands. Yeah, they yeah. They went up for like $4. Yeah. <laughs> No, yeah, there's some there's some cheap people out there. Oh yeah. But I don't mind a haggler. Yeah. <laughs> I, I I try to I try not to do it too bad, but you know five dollars right. off, you know. There you go. Yeah. No, they're cool enough for forty dollars. <laughs> that will work. What do we say? Forty. Yes. Thank you. Forty bucks, yes, ma'am. Y'all yeah, have a good weekend. Good morning. Good morning. <clears throat> you know how much your pots are? I take two dollars for all of it. Two dollars, okay. I'll do that. Okay. That's a, that's a still of a deal. Okay. Gotcha. Thank you. Y'all yeah, have a good weekend. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Hello. So, yeah. Hey. Hi. Hi. Oh, yeah. 
Hi. Oh yeah. <laughs> still here? What's up? Yeah. What's up? Hi. If we're cleaning up, fifty cents. Oh yeah. Got a lot of coins. Uh huh. Hey. Take it. What's up? I think your daddy's waiting Hi. on you. Hi. Your daddy waiting nah, on you. I live right here. Oh. <laughs> Hi. All the time. He's such a sweet. Uh huh. Come on, let's go run something. <laughs> I got the zoomies. Uh huh. He's so happy. Good morning. Good morning. How you doing? A little cold this morning, huh? It is. It's, it's starting. It'll, it'll warm up, though. Yeah. <laughs> it'll be a nice day. <clears throat> How much is your turntable? Ten bucks, man. Ten bucks. Uh, the little belt on it. Uh huh. Was bad. It was bad. It came off. Yeah. And I hadn't messed with it since. We bought it for a New Year's party. Yeah. <laughs> Seven years ago, probably. <laughs> we moved. Uh, it worked. We packed. We moved. The belt came off. But when we moved, so the belt just needs to be put back on. That's it. Okay, ten bucks. Put that back in there. All right, I think I'm situated. Thanks, boss. Thank you, sir. Yeah, man. Hey, y'all have a good weekend. Enjoy you too. Good morning. How much do I have on this? Uh, three. Okay. And you know how much do you have on your little craftsman toolbox? Five. So eight for the pair? Yeah. I think I can do that. Alright, All right, eight dollars. Thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate it. Same to y'all. Good morning. <clears throat> Good morning. Baseball mat. Hmm? How much is your baseball bat? Twenty bucks. Twenty bucks. Can I do a little bundle deal with y'all? You got twenty plus fifteen. That's thirty-five. Plus ten is forty-five. Plus five is fifty. Would you do forty for everything? So ten dollars off. That's not fair. All right, cool. I'll do that. I appreciate that. Save me a little money in my wallet. <laughs> oh, Forty dollars. Oh, I don't, don't want to get near the puppy. <laughs> I don't want to get bit. It looks it looks it looks vicious. <laughs> What's her name? Piper. Oh, that's the name of our dog. Oh, yeah. yeah, we we have a teacup chihuahua oh, named Piper. Yeah. yeah, that's awesome. Let me see. Hold on one sec. The truck's unlocked. Yeah. I bought it and she quit softball. Oh, really? Yeah. Would you do eight on it? Cool. Thank you. One, six, seven. Eight dollars. Don't bite me. Thanks, sir. All right, thank you. <laughs> All right, y'all try to stay warm. Same to y'all. All right, guys, we just got done with that yard sale, and my wife had to point it out, right? You know, gotta, gotta, gotta give her her credit, okay? She she picked up that white uh, Mizuno glove, but I didn't know it was a fast pitch model because I obviously didn't pick it up and look. Um, usually Mizuno stuff, you know, gloves aren't really that great, but I think due to it being the fast pitch model, I think it will sell. Um, but my wife gets credit for that fine, it's just, I told her, oh yeah, that's cool, you know, in the video, but I didn't tell her to get it because I didn't know it was a fast pitch model. So, 
Had to give credit where credit's due, because you know, if not, I'll hear about it for the rest of the day. Yes, you will. All right, let's get back into the video. Good morning. I'm doing good. Oh. Tons of different stuff from karate bags to books. Okay, yeah. How much is your puzzle here? This puzzle, um, I'll do 10 for it. Okay, I'll, I'm going to show it to my wife real quick to see if she wants it, okay? You want it? Brand new seal? Sure. You want it? Okay. Yeah. We'll take that. What are these? Those are some pretty old shoes. How much are you asking on those? Uh, my dad said 15, but lowest he'll go is 10. I was I'll do 10 on them. That sounds good. All okay, right. so I got 20 right there. 20. Alright, and I'll then, keep looking. Oh. That switch case, I'll do a dollar on. Okay. Switch case for a dollar. Yeah, and then we'll do. Uh, Paperback book like this for yeah. 25 cents to 50 cents. Okay. You don't have any video games, do you? Um, I do have video games upstairs, but they're mainly Switch games. Do you want to sell them? I mean, I'm, I'm willing to buy them. If, really? Uh, yeah. Are uh, you fun waiting here? Yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll keep looking. I'll, All right, you yeah. can look. Yeah, I'll keep looking, and I'll, I'll stay right here until you get back. Okay. okay. The kid's very nice. Very, very nice. Hey, Charlie. <coughs> there's there's two more Harry Potter puzzles, but one of them's like actually from like the early 2000s. Do you want it? Because finding the early 2000s stuff is kind of hard to find. You want it? Okay. This one is. This one's just really cool in general. It's made by the New York Puzzle Company. When was it made? I, I can't find a year on it. But it says New York Puzzle. Okay. Okay. I think it's in my brother's Switch and I don't know where he Okay. So I have Super Mario Odyssey. Okay. I have Super Mario 3D Worlds. Okay. And then I have a Pokemon game and Let's Go Pikachu. Okay. Here. Well, how much you want for those? Yeah, I like those. All three? Yeah. I know this is a little hefty, but would you do 60? So it'd be I mean, 20 a piece? Yeah. Would you do that? Okay, let me see. Let me see what I have. Yeah, let me see here. So, all right. So I am going to get these two puzzles. So you said 20 for all three, 20, right? Yeah. Then we got 10. 10, So that'd be 30. 30. Plus a dollar. So that'd be 31. 31 so, so that'd 91, be... If you want to do that. So that'd be $91. Yeah. Let me, let me ask you this. Would you do a bundle deal? All right, let me ask you this. How much How much you want for your Pokemon cards? Uh, all those for five. All those for five? Yeah. Okay, so that would put me at 96. Okay, yeah. for all that. Would you do an even 90, so $6 off since I'm buying all that? Sure, okay, not? cool. 90 for all. Thank you. All right, thank you so hey, do, much. Do you have change for a $100 bill? I think I have I a 10. Let's hope I have a, I've never had a hundred dollar bill before. So well, there you go. It's, it's hundred percent real. I promise. <laughs> All right. Oh, thank you, man. Thank you so yes. much. Yes. I appreciate it. Awesome. I'll help you. <laughs> yeah, of oh course. <laughs> I hope you enjoy the puzzles. Yeah. Yeah. She's, yeah. A, she's a big Harry Potter fan. So. All right. Yeah. I don't use those games anymore. So I was like, sure. Why not? When's it? And who knows? I'm not going to buy Mario Wonder, but if another game comes out. Yeah. You don't have any other games like old school stuff? Um, I think we might have some like like Wii or I mean, anything. I think we have some Wii games. I don't know though. Okay. I, well, if, I, say, if you have any games, I mean, I'd definitely take a look at them. I know. I think I we have some Wii games in the garage. Okay. I mean, I, if you want to get them, I mean, I'll definitely look at them while I'm here. But I mean, if not, it's all good. Video game stuff I found. Wii, new bag. Okay. And I saw this laying in the garage at the corner of my Okay. Eye. Well, how much you want for that? I'll do both for ten if you want. Ten bucks. You want to do that? I'll do all three for ten if you want. Okay, I'm gonna say yeah. Would you do that? Okay, yeah, I'll do that. There you go. All right, thank I you so it, much. Appreciate it, man. Yeah, I appreciate it. Appreciate the Thanks deal. Thanks for spending a hundred dollars. Thank you. All right, thank you. All right, guys, so that's going to be the end of the video. Before I break down these stats for you guys, the kid at the end of this video was such a, I don't know, different type of energy. He was. In my eyes, a young entrepreneur. As soon as I walked up there, he's like, "Yeah, we got some karate stuff. We got this. Yeah, we got that." And, and that right there is something that I, I wish I had whenever I was a kid. I was very inspired by this kid that I had to spend a little bit of money with him because he was just, I don't know, just such a happy kid. Very, uh, uh, not, not I'm, I'm not gonna say humble is the word. He's very uh, bubbly, you know, very uh, ecstatic about stuff. And that one remark he said, "I never had a hundred dollar bill before." That right there just warmed my heart so much that I just I had to. 
I, I had to spend a little bit more money with him. And on top of that, he was willing and dealing. He was like, yeah, I'll do 10 for all this. Uh, you know, I, I think in total, I think I had $96 in total. And I just asked him, would you do a flat 90? He's like, yeah, I can do that. And, you know, no problem. And this, that, and the other. So uh, just a very cool kid. And uh, one thing, too, I do want to note with the stuff that we bought. All the Harry Potter stuff is going to the wife. All the Switch games are going in my personal collection. Um, and I think we only picked up maybe like three or four things from him that was just straight for reselling. Um, the Pokemon cards I did pick up, they're going in my personal collection. There was nothing crazy in there anyways. They're all newer, um, but I just wanted to buy something else from him. Um, but uh, technically, we only spent 20 bucks with him for resale value. So, uh, so definitely not a bad little um, pickup, especially when... We pretty much already made all of our money back and we got some stuff for ourselves you know it's it's, it's such a that's why i love garage sales man <laughs> like even though you're shopping to, to expand your business and, and make you know make some money through your business but sometimes you just find some really cool stuff like the harry potter puzzles that's good like i said going to my wife's collection i found the switch games uh for my collection and and it's better than paying 60 bucks retail <laughs> you know at, at the store so anyways um i'm rambling so let's go and break down these numbers so in total we spent $128 and uh, we walked away with potentially $897 worth of stuff, which means we have sold $110. Now, this video was recorded on November 4th, um, but technically everything didn't get listed until November 10th because we were busy with other stuff. Um, but yeah, we sold $110 worth of stuff, which leaves us with $787 left to resell, which also means too that we're actually still in the negative by uh, $18. Definitely not bad with about a little over a week since we got everything listed. Uh, that DeMarini bat sold very, very, very quick. Technically we paid, what, 50 bucks for everything. So we talked them down to 40. So I think we have roughly maybe 10 bucks into it, 10, 15 bucks, something like that into a hundred and it sold within like two days. Um, very, very good stuff. So uh, with that being said, that's gonna be everything that we picked up and uh, that's gonna be the end of the video. So much love. Let's hopefully we get to 10,000 subscribers. Keep, keep me motivated. Make sure you guys like, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. We'll catch you guys next video. It's your boy, Georgia Picker. Peace. I don't wanna wake up.